Babe, help! What? I'm all scruffy and patchy, but if I shave, I'm gonna look prepubescent. Is that what you're gonna wear? Hey! Babe, we look 16. We look at least 20-ish. Good. I feel a lot less skeezy being married to a 20-ish. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. No, no, no. Don't kiss me. You made a vow. <laughs> okay. Game plan. I will be starting with the open face duck machaca ravioli. And I'm starting with the baby ahi tuna with a cherry tomato brulee. We talked about this. You will be starting with the chicken fried sweetbreads with finger lime aioli. I can't do it. I can't eat intestines. It's the signature dish at D'Ambrosio's. I'm afraid. Why can't you order it? Because I know how much you will love it. The guy is amazing. He had this hit restaurant in New Orleans, but he said the jazz was too distracting <laughs> to his craft. <laughs> Do you think they're staring because we're both wearing toms? What? No, these are our fancy toms. Can I help you? Yes, we have a reservation under Michael Rumberger. I'm sorry? Uh, Michael Rumberger. Like the booze in the sandwich. I'm sorry, sir, I don't see a reservation under that name. Really? Because I know I made a reservation do you remember who you spoke with? I don't, uh, but it was six and a half weeks ago. Perhaps you made the reservation for another night. But tonight's our one year wedding anniversary, so. Give me a minute. Don't worry. Worst case scenario, we'll grab a drink at the bar if we have to wait for a table. She basically called you a liar. Let's get you a Prosecco Popsicle. I bet we're in the book. Stop, 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 stop. Right this way. See, there is no conspiracy about keeping us out of the restaurant. You do realize they just threw this table together, right? It doesn't matter because we are about to dine like kings. You still have to order the sweetbreads. Damn it. You're gonna love it. Welcome to D'Ambrosio's. My name's Arthur, I'll be your server this evening. May I bring you any sparkling water or still? Tap. Tap. He hates us. Nobody here hates us. Except maybe that couple that has something against Tom's. Besides, we are about to make that guy's night by ordering one of everything on the menu. <laughs> what? Quail egg shooters? Okay, two of everything. But he doesn't know you're a foodie. He doesn't know we're not just two broke kids who are going to sit here all night playing with the sugar packets when he's already in the weeds and really needs to focus on his party of 10 because hello, automatic gratuity. Sweetie, it isn't the summer of 2011 anymore. You never have to work at Bennigan's again. And yet I still have nightmares where they have oversat my section and I can't refill everyone's waters fast enough. All you have to worry about is eating so much rich food that the idea of having sex later makes you physically sick. Oh, I will rally enjoy your meal because we won't be able to afford to eat like this until our next anniversary. <laughs> Excellent choice. Thank you. May I see your IDs, please? I guess. It was before I had the beard. Yeah, um, thank you. I'll be back with your wine. You can't disagree with me. Anytime you I reboot a franchise. Or... I'm sorry, we ordered the 2008 Savea Nebbiolo. Yes. We ordered the Nebbiolo. This is the Capayano Barolo. So this is an excellent bottle of wine. Oh yeah, for sure. You guys just poached Bon Mott Sommelier last week and that guy knows his grapes. There's no yes, question. And the Barolo and the Nebbiolo are from the same varietal. So totally. The... Totally, absolutely. But the Barolo is so massive and tannic and rich that it might way overwhelm the roasted bone marrow flan, which we ordered and have been waiting for for months. 
Okay, he maybe hates us a little. You think? You can smell every single different ingredient. How cool is that? I guess so. <laughs> you still afraid of those intestines? Maybe. Okay, then I'm just gonna try. Fine. Sweetbreads are all I want to eat for the rest of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Don't antagonize the unhappy couple. They look like they're about six months away from divorce. Maybe complaining about the hooligans at their favorite restaurant is bringing them closer together. We are saving their marriage. Oh my God. We're the Dr. Phil of this restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I wish I could take my belt off. If this belt was removable, I would be taking it off. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take this when you're ready. He didn't even ask us about dessert. That's okay. I'm pretty sure public vomiting is frowned upon in D'Ambrosio's. No, you wanted salted caramel ice cream pearls. Hey, look at me. Happy one year anniversary. Happy one year anniversary. I love you. And I love how your rage is always bubbling just below. Are you fucking kidding me? He charged us for the first bottle of wine and for a dessert we never even ordered? Don't worry. I'm gonna keep it together. We will figure this out with dignity and grace, like adults. Fuck that. Go get him. Sorry tonight didn't go as planned. Are you kidding me? That was so much fun. <laughs> Did you see his face? I made him cry. Yeah, you shouldn't be so proud of that. He clomped us so much stuff. Okay, you can be a little proud of that. Best anniversary ever. Watch your mug. <laughs> <laughs> How are we gonna top this next year? Oh, we should go. There. <laughs> right up there. Right it, up there? Yeah, I hear no. they have all the sweetbreads you could eat. <laughs> this is made okay. of sweetbread. Right. One big old planet of I'm down. intestines. <laughs> <laughs>